I learned from Hussein how to achieve victory while being oppressed. My faith is that the progress of Islam does not depend on the use of sword by its believers, but the result of the supreme sacrifice of Hussein. If India wants to be a successful country, it must follow in the footsteps of Imam Hussein. If I had an army like the 72 soldiers of Hussein, I would have won freedom for India in 24 hours. Imam Hussein's sacrifice is for all groups and communities an example of the path of righteousness. In a distant age and climate, the tragic scene of the death of Hussein will awaken the sympathy of the coldest reader. In order to keep alive justice and truth, instead of an army or weapons, success can be achieved by sacrificing lives, exactly what Imam Hussein did. Imam Hussein is the leader of humanity. Imam Hussein will warm the coldest heart. The sacrifice of Imam Hussein is not limited to one country or nation, but it is the hereditary state of the brotherhood of all mankind. Though Imam Hussein gave his life almost 1,300 years ago, but his indestructible soul rules the hearts of people even today. The best lesson which we get from the tragedy of Sarabella is that Hussein and his companions were rigid believers in God. They illustrated that the numerical superiority does not count when it comes to the truth and the falsehood. The victory of Hussein, despite his minority, marvels me. If Hussein had fought to quench his worldly desires, then I do not understand why his sister, wife, and children accompanied him. It stands to reason, therefore, that he sacrificed purely for Islam. The tragedy of Karbala decided not only the fate of the Caliphate, but also of Mohammedan kingdoms long after the Caliphate had waned and has appeared. No battle in the modern and past history of mankind has earned more sympathy and admiration as well as provided more lessons than the martyrdom of Husein in the Battle of Karbala.
It is Hussein's sacrifice that has kept Islam alive or else in this world there would be no one left to take Islam's name. I congratulate Muslims that from among them, Hussein, a great human being was born who is revered and honored totally by all communities.